Welcome back, Pest Collectors. Since the Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 movie was just released a couple weeks ago in theaters now, I thought, what a great time to share with you the Guardians of the Galaxy Pest dispensers that exist. And they're not all made by Pez. Some of them are from the collaboration of Funko and Pez, where we got the Pop Pez a couple years ago. There's a few of them here in front of me. Even one is mini. <laughs> so let's get started. First Guardians of the Galaxy Pez I want to share with you today is the Groot Pez Dispenser. This is just the full size Groot, it's not the baby Groot, but it's super cool. This Groot Pez Dispenser is Groot's head for the head, which is mostly brown and the stem matches the brown exactly as well. And the next one I want to share with you is Rocket. This is the raccoon, if you're not familiar with the movie. This is a full size Rocket Pez because I'm going to be sharing with you the mini one here in a couple seconds. This Rocket Pez dispenser is Rocket's head for the head, which is mostly brown and black and some like lighter grays. The stem is a really nice bright orange color. I love the color combination on the Rocket Pez a whole lot. Both of these were released back in 2017 and they're still for sale on Pez.com if you want to buy them. Or you can always, you know, check eBay or Facebook and stuff like that. But I just mentioned that because they've been released for a couple years now, but Pez is still making them. And since the movie is hot, you might want to add these to your Pez collection. Also in 2017, we got this Guardians of the Galaxy Pez Twin Pack, and inside there you'll see Groot. And then there's also a mini Rocket Pez, and oh my gosh, I don't know why I haven't opened this one yet, but I'm going to be opening it today on this video. <laughs> this box set is so nice, I love the graphics on it, I think that's one of the reasons I haven't opened it yet. There's the side, back, still has Rocket and Groot. <laughs> Rocket and Groot. Rocket and Groot and the really cool Guardians logo is on it as well, like all over. And a cool galaxy design. I think that's one reason I really like this because it has like the space theme and the purples and the yellow. It just looks so nice. I do have two of these, so don't worry about me opening it. <laughs> I did buy an extra one to open. So let's open this up. And you know, if you've been watching my videos, I'm trying to get all the mini Pez that exist. So finally I'm opening up Rocket. <laughs> I don't think there's a lot of mini Pez left that I haven't shown you here on the channel. I need to look and see. I know for sure I'm missing some Pez International ones still that are probably going to be pretty hard to find if I ever do find them. And of course like the Japanese mini ones, which I'm working on getting all those, but that's going to take a long time too because some of them are really, really hard to get. Before I show you that, look at the inside there. There's the Guardians logo printed on the back. This is what we want to see. What's inside the box? There's the mini rocket and the regular size Groot. <laughs> Let's see. Let me double check to make sure that this Groot is the same as this Groot because sometimes they make them over in different years or different factories. No. They're both 7.5 made in Hungary. I don't know, they look the same to me. If you have found any variations on these Groot Pez or Rocket, let me know. For now, I'm gonna put this one off to the side. <laughs> this is what I want. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Here's the mini Rocket Pez dispenser. It's just a mini. This Rocket Mini Pez is Rocket's head for the head. Same colors as the regular size one with the bright orange stem as well. It's just that this stem is half the size as a regular Pez. Here's a side-by-side -side comparison of both of the Rocket Pez so you can see the mini size versus the regular size. And I'm just double checking the face here. They look identical to me. If you see anything different on these, let me know. But the two I have here, I don't see any differences. Like the eyes look the same, the paint looks the same. The fact that these were all made in 2017 probably really helps as well to keep everything like super consistent with like the colors and the paint colors. Oh my gosh. <laughs> The Guardians of the Galaxy Pez Twin Pack came with six packs of Pez candy, which is probably expired by now. I always say that when I open old stuff, but to remind myself not to eat this. <laughs> or give it away to friends and family. Gotta put it in a different stack. Well, I was down at my Pez shelves looking for these Guardians of the Galaxy Pez, and I'm like, I thought there was a Star-Lord. And then I was like, oh wait, I know where the Star-Lord's at. It's hanging on my wall with the Pop Pez. Because check it out, here's the Star-Lord Pop Pez dispenser. Super cool. This Star-Lord Pop Pez was part of the collaboration between Funko and Pez. And these were released back in 2018. I believe if I'm remembering right, that these were part of like the first wave of some of the Pop Pez that were released 
by Funko and Pez. So it's pretty cool. There's a few other Marvel characters that go along, I guess, in the same series. But since I'm only showing the Gardens of the Galaxy Pez today, I figured I'd just grab Star-Lord. <laughs> I was just getting ready to open this and it says Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. And I just looked it up, so Gardens of the Galaxy Volume 2, the movie was released back in 2017. And the first movie, the Volume 1 and 1, I guess you call it, was released back in 2014. So all these Pez were made for the second movie. Which sounds like a Pez thing because it seems like, unless something's like super popular, they don't usually make the Pez for it. But the first movie was really good, I think. At least in my opinion. I know it went, I think, over well with the Marvel fans as well, so. So Pez is probably like, let's make these. Oh, these always look so much better outside of the box. Why do I keep these in the box? I don't know. I love the packaging, but I also love them outside of the box. There you go. Take a closer look at the Star-Lord Funko Pop Pez. Looks pretty cool. Star-Lord is wearing his mask. He doesn't always wear the mask in the movie. I don't think that's a spoiler, but this Star-Lord Pez dispenser is Star-Lord's head for the head, which is mostly a silver gray color because of his mask. His hair is brown. There's a lot of texture on the Pez head. It looks really nice. The stem is a really bright red that matches almost the same red as the eyes. I should say the Funko looking eyes because Funko Pops, they always have like the circle eyes and that's what they did with the Funko Pop Pez as well, which I think looks really nice. If you don't know, Star-Lord is like the main character and then Rocket and Groot, they, you know, are all like buddy buddies and they do the, you know, adventures together in the movie. So that's pretty fun. Also in 2018, we got this Funko Pop Pez of Star-Lord. And this one was a limited edition of 3,200 pieces. And oh, and look, it's gold. I mean, what was I just saying about gold Pez in my last video? Because they made a lot of gold Pez at some time, like over a few years or so. This is one of them and I think it looks really nice. This was a Funko Shop exclusive, so you could only buy it on the Funko website. They only made 3,200 of them, which is not a lot, and they sold out super fast. I wasn't even able to get one of these on the Funko site. I ended up buying it from eBay like later, you know, in the year because they sold out so fast. But nowadays, you can find these all day on eBay. So I don't know if a lot of sellers bought these or a lot of Funko Pop collectors bought these and then now they're getting out of Funko Pop collecting or, or what. But there's a lot of these for sale. <laughs> they're not as rare as you think that they should be for... 3,200 pieces. Let's open it up. I always do mention it, but I take a knife and if you just pry open the top really easy, you won't rip the corners of these boxes. Cause I think it's really easy to like rip these little corners here on these Funko Pop boxes. But if you just pry it open with a knife, really simple, you should be fine. Then you can reseal it afterwards. A lot of people do display their Funko Pop Pez on the shelves. I do have mine hanging up in shadow boxes on the wall. I like keeping them in their boxes, but it's just a preference, I think. Look at that all gold Star-Lord Pest dispenser. Isn't this thing like super nice? I love the gold. And there are a couple more gold Funko Pop Pez, Marvel ones, I guess, that go with the Star-Lord. So if I ever make that gold video like I was talking about before, I'll have to add those to the video for sure. But for now, only Guardians of the Galaxy Pez. <laughs> The head on the Star-Lord Pez is Star-Lord's head, which is all gold. The stem is all gold. It's all gold. There's no color or anything on this. It's all gold. The last one I want to share with you is Yandu. <laughs> this one was also released back in 2018. It's another Funko Pop Pez, you can't tell by the box. This is a really fun one. So Yandu was in the first and second movie, I believe. I don't know if he's in the third movie. I didn't see the third movie, but I'll wait until it comes on Disney Plus to watch it. That's what I usually do nowadays. I used to always go to the movies and like watch the movies like right away when they came out. But now that we have Disney Plus and I have a pretty nice theater here at my house, I don't mind waiting just a little bit for the movies to come like to Disney Plus or the other streaming platforms. But I really do like Marvel movies a lot. I think these characters are a lot of fun. Here you go, here's a closer look at the Yandu Pop Pez dispenser. <laughs> this Yandu Pez dispenser is Yandu's head for the head, which is mainly all blue. He's got the red mohawk on top. The stem matches the red on the mohawk and the eyes as well. The red stem is the same color as the one on Star-Lord, which matches. These look so cool outside of their boxes. These are all the Guardians of the Galaxy Pez dispensers that Pez and then Funko and Pez released. What one's your favorite? I'm really loving the mini Rocket Pez and the gold Star-Lord, <laughs> but they're all really, really nice. The details on these are really nice. They got a lot of texture. They're just, I think, really well designed. 
It looked great. I wish we did have some more Guardians of the Galaxy characters, but it doesn't seem like we're going to be getting any anytime soon. So I'd love to just to see more Marvel characters, I think, even in general. Since I am such a big Marvel fan, I think there's a lot of characters that they could still make. There's still a lot of Marvel movies to come, so I guess you never know. If you don't have these in your collection and you're wondering where you can buy these at, the first two here, Groot and Rocket, you can still buy on Post.com like I said at the beginning. The twin pack with the regular size Groot and the mini Rocket is now retired, so you're gonna have to check eBay or check your favorite Pez Facebook group to buy that set. These Funko Pop Pez, you can find them all day long on eBay. You would think that the 3200 of the gold ones would make them more pricey, but they sell all day on eBay for you know, about five or seven dollars each. And I say each because there's a couple more in this gold series as well. All these should be pretty easy to find if you don't have them for your collection. But do you have these in your collection? Let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you. If you have seen the Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 movie, don't leave any spoilers in the comments, but you know, let me know what you thought of the movie. I'd love to hear from you. I love talking about movies and TV shows. That'd be a really fun conversation to continue down below in the comments. Well, that's it for this video. If you want to follow me or reach out to me over on social media, I'm Eric Clutch Pez over on TikTok, Instagram, or Facebook. I'd love to hear from you guys. Tell me what Pez you added to your collection this week. I'd love to hear from you. If you want to help support my channel, I do have merch. I have Pez art, or you can buy me a Pez dispenser. There's links all down below in the description in case you do want to check it out. But as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you Thursday. Bye! I write to you in poetry with words left on the shelf. Full of dust, you'll know it's me and from no